Well, part of it has been experience. So I'm in settings often on an a being asked questions on things that I know. So that's helpful. But I think the sort of a rule of thumb I've always adopted is that I will never give a false answer. So I'm very comfortable with saying, I'm not really clear about what you're asking there. Can you can you share more with me? Yeah. Or I, I'm not sure if, if so sometimes I'll get clarification to make certain that I know what it is they're asking. Mm -hmm. And there are other times when I'm pretty clear about that, I, I try to answer the question. First off, I, was, I went through a training called Seven Second Messaging. Mm -hmm. And part of that Seven Second Messaging is to think about when I'm going to be asked sort of hot questions, what are my answers? And one of them is not to answer the question that's asked but give the answer that I want. So don't repeat negative things. Mm -hmm. So don't you think it's true that community colleges are um, places where individuals who can't go anywhere else go? And I don't want to say, no, I don't think it's a place <laughs> where people who have no place else to go. I'll say community colleges are a fabulous place, and we provide an opportunity for so many individuals. We're the first choice for many individuals because we're close and affordable. And for some of our individuals who've had some challenges, we're a great place for them to go and have a new beginning. I don't talk about that negative side, and so I don't even really answer that question. Well, I think that it responds to it. I, res well, I respond to a question, but I don't, I don't respond to the negative aspect of it. I'll, I'll try to think about what's the message I want to get across. Because I don't believe those things are true, so why should I take up my time responding to things that I don't believe are true? I just need to fill my time with what is true and what is my experience. And so don't waste it to, to talk about what isn't. Talk about what is. So that's part of what I do.